Let's take a look at the Sharpen tool, and it is exactly what it sounds like. You find it under the Blur tool, and as opposite of the Blur tool, it sharpens parts in your image. This is useful when a photo is too blurry, like this one. The whole face is kind of blurred, but I hope I can save it using the Sharpen tool. Let's take a look at the options. I want to keep an airbrush with soft edges. I leave this. The size, however, is too big, so let, take, let us take this down. This will be fine. I leave the mode to normal, and the strength 50% is fine. I don't want it too strong. Then just click and drag over the parts you want to sharpen, and the eyes in this case is um, very important. Be careful though, because using the Sharpen tool too much, it will destroy the pixels. But I think this looks fine. Let's have a look in the Undo history, before and after. Yeah, it works fine. And this is the Sharpen tool.